Welcome back. This is Gyro Gear Loose with RV Hacking on the Cheap. Last year I built this all-in-one pedestal tester. It's a bit of an ugly abomination, I realize, but it was a proof-of-concept prototype for my eventual project. At the time I promised I was going to miniaturize this and make it a little bit more attractive and clean. And with the help of COVID being trapped in my basement laboratory instead of the RV, I'll now show you the results of that. Let's get rid of this abomination. Instead, I found this. It's actually uh, Edison to a TT30 adapter plug, but it's the, also the perfect size and shape to be a project housing. I'll just cut out this back ring, hollow out the, the contents, and that'll give me a TT30 plug on the front with a plastic enclosure. Then I'll replace the back opening with some smoked plastic and an OLED screen behind it. That's right, this is going to read in plain English exactly what's going on with the pedestal. Inside the enclosure, we'll add an OLED screen, a, a piezo beeper to warn us when something's wrong, a microcontroller that will control and coordinate everything, and of course, my secret sauce that will detect the waveform on a single wire. No, that's not actually the, r the right secret sauce, sorry. And here's the final result. I spent a lot more time on the guts than the, the GUI, and it shows, but I think it works. Of course, before plugging in, I can still do this. Which does not display a warning message on the screen, of course, but does make an audible tone as a warning. Now, let's run it through all the other possible wrong wirings and see how it displays. This has been Gyro Gear Loose with RV Hacking on the Cheap, and I hope you've enjoyed seeing my weird little hacking project. Please remember to like, subscribe, hit the little bell, and do a little dance, as long as it's not because you touched a hot skin. Be safe, and we'll see you next time.